In this video I'll explain how to extract and count unique values from a data frame column using the R programming language. So without too much talk, let's dive into the R code. So in this video I will show you an example and this example is based on the data frame that we can create with lines 1 to 3 of the code. So if you run these lines of code you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new data frame object is appearing which is called data. And if you click on this data object a new window is opened which is showing the structure of our data frame. And as you can see our data contains 5 rows and 3 columns which are called x1, x2 and x3. And you can also see that some of these columns contain duplicates. So for instance, the column X2 contains the values one and two multiple times. So let's assume that we want to list all the unique values in our data frame columns. Then we can apply the code that you can see in lines five and six. So in line five of the code, I'm using the lapply function and I'm applying this function to our data frame and within the lapply function, I'm specifying that I want to apply the unique function to all columns of our data frame. So if you run line five of the code, you can see that a new list object is appearing at the top right, which is called list unique. And we can print this list to the bottom in the RStudio console by running line six of the code. And after running this line of code, you can see that we have created a list containing three list elements and each of these list elements corresponds to one of our columns. So for instance, the first column is represented by the first list element, which is called x1. And as you can see, the first column contains the unique values 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So in other words, there are no duplicates in the first column. However, the second column contains only the unique values 1 and 2, as I have shown you already before. And the third column contains only one unique value, which is the character letter X. So in this first example, I have shown you how to extract the unique values from our data frame columns. However, it's also possible to count the number of unique values in each column. And we can do that as you can see in lines eight and nine. And in these lines of code, I'm using the rapply function and I'm applying this function to our data set. And within the rapply function, I'm also specifying a user defined function in which I'm checking the length of the unique values in each column. So if you run lines eight and nine of the code, another object is appearing at the top right, which is called count unique and we can print this data object to the RStudio console at the bottom by running line 10 of the code. And then you can see another output at the bottom in the RStudio console. And as you can see, the first column X1 contains five unique values. The second column contains two unique values and the third column X3 contains only one single unique value. So in this tutorial, I have explained how to extract and count unique values in data frame columns using the R programming language. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on my homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the R programming code of this video in some more detail. And I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video. Furthermore, if you have liked the video, I would be very happy if you leave me some positive feedback in the comments and make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time.